Hi, welcome to Savap. I'm Ivan and today I'm going to show you how to generate an embedded code in Power BI for your reports so that you can easily share them with your team and any other stakeholders. Now the need for seamless collaboration within the AEC industry is something that is critical to the success of every project and yet it still remains a huge challenge. This is largely due to the persistent technology limitations and yet despite the advent of advanced tools and BIM software we are still struggling with interoperability issues as well as these different systems and platforms often lack the capability to communicate effectively with each other and this ends up creating data silos and obstructing exchange of vital project information. So Savap has come up with a unique solution. You can use Savap to integrate all of your BIM data then build interactive dashboards using Microsoft's Power BI. Both tools are easily accessible to everyone. There's no need to install any programs or software and they can enhance the collaboration spirit ensuring that the right information reaches the right people at the right time. This is the final step in the Power BI and Savap process and it will give anyone easy access to the BIM data contained in any of your dashboards, whether they're custom built or one of our free Savap templates. Our templates actually have a 3D geometrical BIM viewer integrated directly into them. So once the dashboard is published to the web, then anyone with the link will be able to access BIM data contained within the reports quickly and efficiently. So first of all, you'll need to have your report open in Power BI service. We have a video tutorial on everything from how to create your first Savap project to how to build a Power BI template file and how to publish your reports on Power BI service. I'll drop a link in the description below for you to go and take a look at them. Now let's go to app.powerbi.com in order to open your report. Then click on my workspace down here on the left side. That will bring up all of our reports that we have published. So let's open up the report that we want to publish to the web by clicking on it. Now, once your report is open, you'll see along the top of your dashboard here that you have a range of options. So simply click on a the file, then four options will come up. SharePoint Online, Website or Portal, Publish to Web, Public, or Developer Playground. If you click on Publish to Web, that will bring up a link that you can share with your team. Or you can copy the link to embed the report into a website or a secure portal. Now, when you open up the link, it will display your dashboard and it's completely interactive. So you can find the information that you need in just a few clicks. Plus, Whenever you update your dashboard, this will also automatically update all of the links that you have already shared with your team. For us at Savap, we truly believe that this is the future of BIM collaboration. It simplifies the whole process for you and your company, making BIM more manageable and accessible. If you'd like to know more, then head over to our website and sign up with us for our freemium plan to take a look at how Savap can actually revolutionize your own BIM process. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it and subscribe for more content. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.